don't mind our corny music. We're just here to share some of our newer Polaroid finds that we have yet to test or make any other videos on. First up is a Polaroid 250 LAN camera that I got from the Swap Meet. I'm not gonna tell you how much I got it for because you're gonna be real jealous. It came with a broken case and a lot of accessories. The flash component, flash bulbs, cold clip, it also came with the original manual and a portrait close-up attachment, which I'm really excited to try. I'm planning on taking this camera with me on my honeymoon so you guys will be able to check out some cool shots when I get back. Next up we have the Polaroid Mini Portrait, which was another uh, swap meet find actually. And this one is super cool. I'm not even exaggerating about that. I haven't tried it yet, but it shoots it has two separate frames for one peel apart image it actually came with three polaroid backs so i have two 545 backs which would um, take the new 55 film which i'll link to in the description it also came with a back to take the fuji fp 100c or 3000b which is still being made by fuji film so that's great I'm just going to start stocking up, you know, just in case. I'm really excited to use this camera on my wedding day. I want to take a portrait of me and my future husband on either side of a print, so I really um, can't wait to see how that comes out. And lastly, I have Polaroid J66. I accidentally bought maybe six of these. I have a lot and there isn't any film made for them at the moment so I'm planning on experimenting with them. I want to use some 4x5 film, maybe some roll film. I just want to, you know, play have a chance to play around with a camera that I really don't care too much about what's going to happen to it. So, well, that's it. Uh, those are my Polaroid cameras that I have not yet tested and here's a lovely closing shot of Gracie and I'm gonna ask you again to please subscribe. I'm planning on doing a lot of camera work this fall and winter of course after my wedding and honeymoon which I'll be shooting lots of pictures on so stay tuned.